Here we're going to talk about the right pane. This is the place where when we click on the start menu we look over to this particular right side and basically what it's going to show you are areas that you might frequently use. In this first part you're going to notice that this is your personal folder and that's going to reflect the name of the person who is currently logged in and so with that it has files for that particular person. If you move down to documents this is where you can store any type of text files, spreadsheets, presentations, any type of files of that nature. If you click on pictures, that's going to give you a pictures folder where you can store your own personal digital images. If you move down to music, this stores your music files. If you click on games, these are for the areas where you can access all the games on your computer. And if you move down a little bit further, you'll notice that you have the computer area, which is also noted on the desktop screen, and that'll give you access to different cameras, printers, cameras, provided that those items are on your particular system. Also, if you look further down, this is the control panel, and this will give you access to that particular area so that you can customize the appearance as well as the function of your computer. And if you move down, you'll notice that you have devices and printers, and what this will do is allow you to add or remove different printers or devices from your system, and this is the default programs area, which allows you to customize which types of activities you want to use for browsing, pictures, sending email, and so forth and the very last area is for help and support and this will allow you to open the Windows help area to ask questions if you're having any challenges with using your system.